Hey, welcome back guys to the Minecraft Multi Force. Today we're going to be building some FMTVs or family of medium tactical vehicles. So we have two different main trucks here. This right here is the M1083. It's a five ton truck. Here's what it looks like. And then right next door is the M1078. And this has one less axle and it's the 2.5 ton truck. Very nice design and they are both in a kit configuration where the US Army in 2006 they came up with LTAS which is a long term armor strategy uh, program and they basically got these armored cabs and there's also like another configuration of this called a B kit where they have even smaller windows in this so if you guys look up like on Google if there's like a different FMTV it might be that one and um, yeah. Here's what it looks like and we also am going to be showing you comparison between the new one and the old one. You can see this is actually my first video that I made the FMTV. Really huge wheel so I downscaled it to make it more accurate. More like 1.5 uh, blocks long. Like that also added like the detail right here on the sides. And a lot of things were more accurate. I also I am using 1.16 now since Foxshot just updated yesterday which is pretty nice. So I'm using I'm using some blackstone uh, blocks right here. And uh, back over here we have some of tarps. <laughs> so you can add this to the back of the truck. If you want to add some coverings. And I also am working on uh, expansible van version variant of it. And let me know in the comment section if you guys are interested in this. Uh, you can just like make all sorts of trucks. There's like a lot of different variations. There's like another one that's a record but I haven't made it yet. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys do enjoy the design. And the army isn't just tanks and Humvees. There's also like some logistical vehicles. And uh, this is mainly used by the Army National Guard. I've seen this a lot. Also, the Marine Corps, they use this as well. Uh, but anyways, let's get started. So first off, I'm going to be building um, the 4x4 variant. And then I'm going to modify it to this one. And then I'm going to show you how to make the tarp. And just be aware for this one. Uh, they're both like I believe 10 blocks long in real life It's like a half block longer on one of them, but in Minecraft it doesn't really matter So it won't be that big of a difference when we convert it So to get started we're gonna take our materials. I'm gonna take out sandstone stairs smooth sandstone stairs smooth sandstone smooth sandstone slab sandstone slab cut sandstone uh, black concrete birch trap door uh, what else? Uh, another brick slab. That's it for now. So we're going to add the pairs of wheels in the front. So just add in two black concretes spaced apart, two blocks. Add in another brick slab on top. And then the front here, we'll add in a birch trap door in front of it. And then we'll add in an upside down sandstone stairs right on top of it. I'm going to place some blocks temporarily. And it's going to be cornered on the inside part. Same thing on the other side. That. Then the inside part, we're going to add in a 2 by one of black concrete. And below that, we'll add in sandstone slab. Just between that for the axle. Then on top, we'll add in a smooth sandstone stairs. And they're going to be upside down, uh, back to back. And we want to have like two pairs of that. Then on top, we'll add in black concrete on the left hand side. Make it two blocks long. And then next to it, we'll add in a birch trap door. Open that up. Add in black concrete on the side here. Make it two blocks long as well. And then black concrete on the inside. Then we'll add in um, birch trap doors on the ends. And then an acacia trap door right above that birch trap door. And then a birch trap door next to it. Then we'll add in a birch fences on the sides for the side view mirrors. And we'll add in a lever underneath uh, one of the trap doors. You want to make sure it's like facing towards the inside of it. Then we'll go on top of the cab. We'll add in a 2x4 of smooth sandstone slabs. Then side here, we'll add in um, sandstone wall right behind the black concrete. 
and then smooth sandstone block here and then smooth sandstone stairs upside down right behind it and we'll do the same thing on the other side like so and the inside part of this that looks to be just two sandstone stairs like that and then the inner part of this we're going to fill that in with bedrock like that I suppose if you're using survival, you use another block. Anyways, uh, we'll add in a cut sandstone. And we're going to make this so it's going to be 2x4. So, 2 blocks wide and 4 blocks long. Then we'll add in sandstone block, which you need to grab. And we're going to make a 2x3. Then the back will add in two back-to-back -back upside down sandstone stairs. Alright, in this back portion, uh, we'll skip a block here, add black concrete on the side. Other side, same thing. And then we'll add in another brick slab on top and a black stone wall right behind it. Add in black stone wall behind the front wheel as well. And birch button right inside the wheels. Alright, and then for the axle for this, we'll connect that using sandstone slab. Then we'll add in a birch trap door. It's going to be right here, and we want to we want to actually like <laughs> make it like this, I guess, like a straight line down. So you'll have to place a block temporarily just to place it right. It's gonna be like, I guess, open like that. And then right here in the middle, we'll add in two sandstone stairs like that. And then on the edge, we'll add smooth sandstone stairs facing towards the front of the vehicle. And then two sandstone stairs facing outwards. And then a cut sandstone. And then sandstone stairs. And then smooth sandstone stairs. And then we'll go on the other side and pretty much do the same thing. So two stairs like that. Cut sandstone. Sandstone stairs. And then smooth sandstone facing the back with the stairs. Alright, then um, right on this edge here we'll add in two more sandstone stairs like that. And then on the front and the back we'll add in uh, these birch trap doors two blocks wide. While well, the edges are going to be cut sandstone slabs all the way across. Then we're going to make uh, this area into like a 2x2, two two, which is nether brick uh, stairs. Just a spare tire. And then we'll add in smooth sandstone stairs facing each other right in the back of this uh, cab. We got a nice window here. Also add in uh, this birch fence gate, open that up towards cap. And then on the side here, we'll add in an upside down sandstone stairs. And there appears to be a blackstone, um, I wonder what it's called, blackstone wall and then blackstone polished blackstone brick slab. That's a long name. <laughs> so I'll add those two. Alright, and then the inside of this, we're going to add in a row of birch signs across. Other side, same thing. Alright, and then on the back here, we'll add in a acacia button and the blackstone button underneath, right on the sides. The middle, we'll add in uh, two birch trap doors like that. And sides will add in a gray banner right there. Then we'll add in a cut sandstone slab right here, followed by a dark oak uh, trap door. Close that up. But then another cut sandstone block, I mean slab right there. And then there's going to be uh, two sandstone slabs at the bottom, right there, and then two. Uh, birch trap doors underneath that like so all right next we'll add in a birch button right here to the side other side same thing birch button 
Then go down here, add in a smooth sandstone slab right there. Birch trap door, close it up. And then two uh, birch trap doors. And nether brick stairs with a birch sign in the front of that. Then we'll add in two cut sandstone uh, slabs. The dark oak trap door, close it up. And then go down here and add in a lever. So this is going to be the exhaust pipe. And then, yeah, that's actually pretty much it on how to build the FMTV. Um, the 2.5 ton variant. Now we're going to convert this if you want to make uh, the 5 ton variant, which has another wheel here. So it's actually quite similar. So we're going to go back over here. All right, so first thing we're going to do, we're delete this slab here and the trap door. And then we'll move this lever one block forward. Then we're going to skip a block here and add in another pair of wheels, black concrete, another brick slab on top, black stone wall behind it, and then a birch button on the side. Other side will be the same exact thing. Delete this, another brick slab, black stone wall right behind, and the inside part we're going to add in sandstone slabs. Then we'll delete the slab here, add a dark oak uh, trap door like this, so it's closed up. Then we'll add in a gray banner right underneath it like so. Go back to the other side, add in a gray banner in front of this wheel like that as well. Alright, so yeah, that's actually um, pretty much it on how to build uh, both versions. Now I'm going to be showing you how to build it with the... What do you call this? The tarp in the back. So it's actually really, really easy. All we have to do is take out stripped birch wood. And this this can go to for any variant of it um, since they're the same length. So we're going to add in birch or stripped birch wood, two blocks tall. And then we'll delete the side wall here and just extend it so it's two blocks tall. Make sure they're facing all the same direction. And then we're going to connect the roof together all the way across. And then we're going to connect the front part together. And again, make sure they're facing the same direction. All right, I think that's good. And after we're done with that, we're going to take out um, birch button. And we're going to add in a pair like this spaced apart. And unfortunately, you can't, you can't really add in uh, all these buttons, but you can still add in that one black stone button right there on the side if you are using vanilla Minecraft. And you can see this is the inside. And I suppose if you guys do want more room, you can change this up to a slab maybe. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it on how to build the FMTVs in Minecraft. I hope you guys do enjoy this video. It's my first ground design built by my own design in a long time. So I do hope you guys enjoy it. And let me know if you guys do want to see other variants of the FMTV, such as the expansible van, or I'm just gonna be building it for myself. Um, but anyways, I will see you guys in the next one.